Norovirus is a viral infection that causes gastroenteritis, which is the inflammation of the stomach and intestines. It is known for outbreaks in closed and crowded spaces, such as schools, nursing homes, and cruise ships. Norovirus is a highly contagious disease, which is why it causes so many outbreaks and is considered one of the most common viral infections. It can cause abdominal pain, diarrhea, and vomiting. Diarrhea is the most commonly reported symptom. About 90% of people with a norovirus infection experience diarrhea. This diarrhea is watery and sudden, usually severe and frequent, creating a sense of discomfort and urgency. In children, this diarrhea is also associated with discomfort and they often cry. Diarrhea occurs because the virus infects the cells of the small intestine, leading to dysfunction instead of absorption. These cells release water into the lumen of the intestine, causing watery diarrhea. The feces may be greenish or yellowish due to the presence of bile pigment. This happens because food moves rapidly through the intestines, leaving insufficient time for the complete breakdown of bile, leading to a greenish discoloration of the stool. The second most common symptom is vomiting, which occurs in 70% of cases. This vomiting is forceful and often comes unexpectedly. In children, vomiting frequently occurs right after eating, and they may refuse to eat due to fear of vomiting. Vomiting occurs because norovirus irritates the lining of the stomach, sending signals to the brain's vomiting center. Nausea is usually the first symptom of norovirus, though it is not the most common. Nausea is the feeling of being sick, a persistent sensation of queasiness or discomfort in the stomach. People often feel sick before any other symptoms appear. Nausea is characterized by feeling sick with a tendency to vomit and occurs in 60% of cases. Stomach pain and cramps occur in 50% of cases. Abdominal cramps are typically described as sharp, intermittent pains in the abdomen. The intensity of the pain can vary, ranging from mild discomfort to severe pain. Inflamed mucous membranes disrupt normal muscle contractions. Additionally, the intestinal muscles contract more vigorously in an attempt to rid the body of the virus, causing cramps and pain. Fever occurs in 30% of norovirus cases. When the immune system detects a viral infection, it releases pyrogens that affect the hypothalamus causing fever. Fever arises because the optimal growth temperature for the virus is close to the normal human body temperature. Raising the body temperature inhibits viral growth. On the other hand, the immune system is more active at higher body temperatures. Fever also increases metabolic speed, enhancing the ability of immune cells to travel to the site of infection and respond quickly to the invading virus. Diagnosis of norovirus is confirmed with stool PCR testing, which detects viral RNA. Common diseases that may be mistaken for norovirus include rotavirus infection, bacterial infections, and food poisoning. The mainstay of treatment for norovirus is supportive care. This includes hydration with oral rehydration solutions, ORS, to prevent dehydration, especially in children and the elderly. A homemade rehydration solution can be made with 1 liter of clean water, 6 teaspoons of sugar, and 0.5 tablespoons of salt. Gradually reintroducing solid foods as tolerated is important, starting with bland, easy-to-digest foods like toast, rice, and bananas. Norovirus typically resolves on its own in 1 to 3 days. The most important aspect of management is controlling dehydration. Severe dehydration and death from norovirus are very rare but can occur in vulnerable patients, such as the elderly and very young children.